the perks of loyalty are way more than the perks of captaincy. Then why am I sleeping in the basement? <laughs> Welcome to the RCB Insider Show. Myself, Mr. Nats, and as you know, on this show there is zero sleaze, only peace. Today with me in this childhood setup is a childhood friend of mine, Virat. <laughs> you really look relaxed. Because I haven't seen you in two years. Actually, more than captaincy, it was the fact that I had to see you every time, every right. season, because I was captain. And that was part of my responsibility. And but I'm, I... I'm writing something on the table. If you guys wanna wanna have a look at this, Nags is back nagging me. This is officially first <laughs> part yeah. of the oh. season. There we go. I'll sign it as well, so that everyone knows. Can we please take a screen grab of this and we will use it in his bank accounts and all. <laughs> so Virat, do you like pets? I love pets. What pets do you have? We don't have any at home because we don't have time to take care of them. No, but recently on TV, everybody saw you got two ducks. <laughs> got two first ball ducks. <laughs> Oh man. What do you plan I, to name them? The, after the second one, I, I actually realized what it feels to be like you. Absolutely helpless. <laughs> <laughs> so it, it hasn't happened to me <laughs> ever in my career, I think. Correct. So that's why I smiled because I felt like I've seen everything now. It's been so long that I've seen everything yeah. <laughs> in this game has to show me. You know, there used to be a rhyme when we were growing up. Old MacDonald had a farm. Yeah, yeah, oh. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. Virat Kohli's lost his farm. Not farm, I mean like farm. Did you ever have a farm? <laughs> <laughs> Moving on. What's happening? These commentators also are not giving you a chance. But they don't, they can't be in my shoes. They can't feel what I feel. Yeah. They can't live my life. They can't live those moments. So yeah. you said, how do you cut out the noise? You, you, you either mute the TV or you don't listen to or pay attention to what people are saying. I do both of these things. So for the benefit of the fans who don't understand this tournament, or how a team works. When you are the captain, you have a certain kind of room. When you become just a player, do you have to get a different kind of room, have like a shared bathroom or something or what is it? The perks of loyalty are way more than the perks of captaincy. Then why am I sleeping in the basement? <laughs> <laughs> this is what happens when you bring me to a kid's area. You want help fixing the chair? No, no, it's okay. I can do it. I have to do. Virat, have but to this do. is Virat, but this is very metaphoric. Why? You lost your seat. No, I lost the back of my seat. I didn't lose my seat. <laughs> what a boss! Give me a five. What a boss! <laughs> okay, so Virat, I want to ask you, <laughs> how much do you miss AB De Villiers? Uh, I miss him a lot. I speak yeah. to him regularly, quite regularly. He keeps uh, keeps uh, messaging me. He was. In uh, the US recently, watching golf. Golf, yeah, yeah. It's Augusta Masters is is what I heard it was called. Yeah. So he told me he was there, experiencing it with his friends and family, and uh, yeah, we stay in touch. He's very keenly, obviously, watching RCB, and hopefully here next year in some capacity. Yeah, I can see it's a fair delivery. Can we go to the ultra edge, please? Hopefully here next year in some capacity. I love you, AB. I love you too much. That's very did interesting. I, did I spill the beans? <laughs> no, the beans are in our cup. <laughs> We're drinking some coffee there. So tell me, recently I got a news from Fraser Town. Okay. A little birdie told me you were around that area after the test match doing something. What was happening? Mm. Um, so we finished the test match. That was the unboxing event day. Yeah, the yeah. same day, yes. Tell me, just cut to footage of my popularity here. Just, I'm very that, po equally popular as you. Yeah, yeah I, even more in Bangalore. Thank I, you. I'm yeah. not, I'm not uh, contesting that, but the, I think it was, it, was, it was the third day that the unboxing event was happening, yeah. and that that's when the test match got over. I was actually tempted to just drive across into the event yeah. and just 
stand in the crowd with my mask on cheering for you <laughs> but yeah. but i chose otherwise yeah. actually uh, as a lot of people know that anushka has almost literally grown up in bangalore okay. and she has so many friends and so many memories from the city i'm, I'm um, one of her friends sorry i'm one of her friends oh really okay she thinks i'm better looking than you just oh who's better looking madam uh, this man <laughs> or me she is saying not even both of us she is saying between both of us also i look good <laughs> yeah i remember that yes yes uh, in you when you forced that answer out of her yes i i remember yes no, no. yeah i didn't force okay whatever she is kind she is generous okay we can have that and i'm handsome after okay so anyway she loves uh, can i take names Yeah, of course, Tom's Bakery. Wow, Tom's Bakery is stock market gone up through the roof. <laughs> World superstar knows Tom's Bakery in present uh, time. So as soon as we got back to the hotel, I thought, you know what, uh, Anushka talks about uh, the puffs there, and yeah. they're very in famous. In Bangalore, we call yes. it puffs. Puffs. Okay. Uh, that's the most favorite thing to eat in Bangalore, apart yeah. from the dosas. I walked into Tom's Bakery. I told the security, sit in the car. I had a mask on. I had a cap on uh, because the mask was mandatory. It was perfect opportunity for me to. experience some normalcy i walked into thomas bakery I, i promise you no one noticed me at all and it was such a liberating feeling because people are buying their stuff i ordered puffs <laughs> i got them packed i went to the counter yeah that's when i actually got nervous because i had my credit card i didn't have cash right so i gave the guy my credit card and i thought okay this is it now i'm gone yeah. and i actually had the security's number like on on my phone ready to dial like yeah. immediately if something happens i'll call him in straight away and you know um but the guy was like that's when i realized the the fame of that bakery he was so busy in his work he did not care whose credit card it was he swiped it i signed it i gave him the the receipt he stamped it and i was like wow he gave me the he didn't even read what's written on it and i was like wow this is amazing this was completely like unexpected and no one actually recognized me at all nice also cheers to tom sankal for living a life where he's run out of rhyming word trucks you figure out what the word is <laughs> what's it like to work with faf I me and faf have always uh, kind of gotten along really well even before we played together this season because he was captain of south africa for a while be yes. honest okay be honest i'm being very honest be honest the bully i'm being him. very honest they bullied him how many of your decisions you are simply going on sliding <laughs> no no i'm only half half is a guy who who was very sure of himself and he okay. has full authority on the field he tells me sometimes i mention things and he tells me no i don't want to do that which i respect a lot right. because that that obviously makes you gain respect for the person you're playing under and he's hot um i every time i see him i giggle really <laughs> just good morning <laughs> I go weak in my knees and run. Yes, Faf is a very good-looking man. Uh, yeah. As I said, we've had mutual respect for many years, even before he played for RCB, yeah. because he was captain of South Africa. Always had some nice conversations yeah. pre-match, post-match. Yeah. So yeah, there was always uh, respect there. But now I've gotten to know him much better, and he's he's a brilliant guy. And yes, so obviously very good-looking guy. Virat, I'm going to give you this paper, mm. and I'm going to give you a pen. Mm. I want you to draw freedom. Okay. Whatever defines freedom for you. even i will draw let's be creative okay cool let's reveal freedom together please okay. come <laughs> what's that it's a 10 crore check signed by your name Um, What is freedom to you? Beautiful. That is you. That is our baby, and that is made up. Yes, that's us. Three of us. That's a house somewhere in the hills. That's yeah. a stream flowing. Yeah. Uh, yeah. That's beautiful. That's freedom. Okay. Why don't you just sign this? Sign this. I am going to sell this as a NFT and make a lot of money. Please support me, friends. If any billionaire or billionaire is watching this video, A, I don't know how you have time to watch this video. B, you can buy this NFT from me. Okay, peace.